is going on guys? It is your host, Eladorius. Guys, welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video. And today I'm going to be telling you guys the first time I ever got in a fight, guys. Now you may ask yourself, whoa, you're a gamer, man, you don't fight. Well, I got in a fight, guys. This was in fifth grade, so it's been a while since this has happened, guys. Now, let me just go straight into this. Why did I want to get in a fight with this kid? Now, I was a fifth grader. Now, in fifth grade, there has to be something that the little kid does to you that makes you mad because usually fifth graders... They don't have such a crazy temper. I mean, they do have a temper, but it's not like, oh my god, I'm gonna kill your family. But it's like, it's something that has to deal with something that really gets you mad. Now, for me, the kid got me mad. Why, you may ask yourself, why did this kid get me mad? So the kid I fought, he had his arm broken, guys. Now, it wasn't broken when we fought, but he was already healing, so he had like a cast on it. Like, the ones that you can take off. And so, yeah, guys, he had this cast, and... I saw my girlfriend wearing it, and I got super pissed off when I saw it, because I'm a little kid. She's my girlfriend. I don't want to see you wearing other kid stuff, man. That You wear my stuff. I gave you my sweater. I don't know if I had... No, I never gave her a sweater or anything. I gave her roses, but I never... Yes, I gave her roses, guys. I was a fifth grader in love, okay? I thought she was the one in fifth grade, but now she's a whore. <laughs> not really, guys. Take that back. I'm not rude. But yeah, guys, I saw her wearing the cast, and in my head, I was like, oh, hell no, man. Are you kidding me? She's wearing this kid's cast. I was like, are you kidding me, man? No. So after school, we were just playing in the playground, guys. You know, we are just doing the monkey bar, swinging, doing little kid shit. I don't know what little kids do nowadays. Probably on their iPhones or hitting up Instagram models. That's what little kids do now. <laughs> nowadays, I feel like it. Back then, we had a little childhood. Now it's like, I am a iPod. I have an iPod. I have a PS4. I have an Xbox. You know, little kids are pretty much, they're pretty much technologized. I don't know if that's a word, but it's a word now. Because I'm making it a word, guys. But yeah, so we were just playing after school, and I see him and his brother come, and they're there. I'm just in my head, I'm just like, better back off because I just already saw my girlfriend wearing your cast. Do you think I want you here right now? I walk up to this kid, and I haven't even said one word, and this is what happened. Boom, I get decked right in the mouth, man. I swear, he just punches me right in the face. He punches me, and my first instinct was, you know what? Take this kid's bike. Take the kid's bike. So. Yeah, so he got off the bike originally, and the bike was just open, they're laying there. So in my head, I'm just like, you know what, take the bike. He has to chase you once you get the bike. So I take the bike, guys, and I start riding. Now, where I used to go to my elementary, used to have, like, it was called the alligator pit. And it was just a bunch of rocks, guys. So my opinion, well, in my head, I'm just like, you know what, I'm going to grab his bike and throw it into the rocks, guys. And I think, if I think, if I throw it enough, it will actually break. And it didn't break, but it just kind of got some scratches here and there, guys. But I was going for it just to get him like away from his other brother so I can be one on one with me. So literally, I throw the bike into the rock pit. I turn around and he's already like five feet away from me. And my first thing is to do is punch him. His other brother, remember this, he had another brother. His other brother comes towards me as well. And you know, he thinks he's gonna get the easy, you know, little fight. Boom, I hit him too. And my instinct since I was watching, I, all right, I was a WWE fan, guys. So once I hit the second brother, I go back to the, his first brother that I hit originally. And I literally punted him. Now, around this time, recently I was watching WWE, and that's what Randy Orton was doing at the time, guys. So in my head, I was like, you know what? My favorite idol is doing it. Why can't I, guys, right? And that was my mindset, guys. That was just my little fifth grade mind, you know, saying, you know, this kid's vulnerable, laying on the ground right there. His head is just calling me, kick me, kick me. I had to do it, guys. I know I was a very crazy little kid, guys. It was so crazy. Now, thinking about it, it's pretty funny. Every time I just remember, I'm just like, dude, I kicked a kid in the head because he wore my girlfriend's cast. Like, what was happening with me? I have no idea, guys. I was a crazy, crazy little kid. I know I was. That's what happens when you watch WWE and your mom lets you. And I'm just kidding, guys. WWE is not even hard, man. It's fake. But in my head, I love, I love watching WWE, guys. Now, that's me. I mean, I still sometimes watch it, which is not like something crazy. Like, oh my god, he does watch WWE. I mean, it's still entertaining, guys. You have to understand, WWE's for fans and everybody. There's YouTube fans. There's old YouTubers. So, yeah, after I kick him in the head, I just run. Um, I had I brought my scooter there originally. So, me and my girlfriend rode scooters. Yes, it was a very cute date, guys. We rode scooters together. Fuck yeah, then we fought. Um, I took off with the scooter, guys. There was a scooter there. I saw it, and I was like, you know what? I'm outie, bro. I'm not going to stay here. I'm probably going to get my butt kicked if I stay here, guys. And, no, I just took off. I just ran home, and that's the end of it. After that, you know, a couple weeks later go by, I break up with my girlfriend. So in the end, you know, I fought for my girlfriend and then I end up breaking up with her. So it's kind of funny. <laughs> it's just, it's weird, right? You know, you fight for a girl and then you end up breaking up with her. But that was in fifth grade, guys. I was a very crazy little kid, punting people in the head. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Thank you guys for coming and peace out. See ya.